first saw this building probably back in the mid 80s when I was a child and it looked pretty much the same way then as it does now uh, there's something about the architecture there's something about the setting there's something about the property itself which caught my eye even as a young child it caught my eye the existing facility was built around the turn of the century uh, there was a, a wooden structure a series of wooden structures that housed the operations prior to that but the office building which is the little building with the turret and the uh, uh, several other buildings that are still there today were built around 1903-1904 and were in operation until the late 60s. Oberlin Smith is an unsung hero of invention and innovation and engineering. But here was a man in South Jersey in Cumberland County who left a lasting impression. He even wrote a theological work uh, a few years before his death where he looked at some of the research and uh, some of the uh, things that he had been involved with in his working life, magnetic recording, um, manufacturing of different things and implements, and he sort of tied in a theological concept to all this and the nature of the eternity of the soul of man. These buildings are standing today because there's a story about Oberlin Smith that has not been told. These buildings testify to his creative genius and innovative genius that these buildings may be just a shadow of, but there's a real story in there that needs to be told. <laughs>